do it, Pauls. And I'm losing my voice, so I apologize. I'm here today because I want the workers of Atlantic County to know that John Amadeo and Chris Brown work every day to expand economic opportunities for working families across Atlantic County. Supporting working families and building one of the best workforces that attract good jobs, good wages, and good benefits is a priority for John and Chris. It's one of the reasons they sponsored the, the legislation to renew the State Transportation Trust Fund. They strengthened it with $3.2 billion in state and federal money, creating over 80,000 80, jobs. And we'll see that right away with the elimination of lights down in Cape May. Next week, the uh, bridge at Beasley's Point in the Garden State Parkway comes out for bid. The 72 bridge up in Manahawkin comes out. So these are very important jobs <coughs> that they created for us. They did one heck of a job on that. And thanks to their leadership, there's a lot of new exciting projects in Atlantic City coming. Margaritaville, 250 construction jobs, 162 permanent positions, fast pro shop at the walk, creating another 150 construction jobs. Casino, uh, Harris Casino Convention Center, 340 construction jobs, 60 to 140 permanent jobs. And that convention center will bring midweek uh, business to the casino industry, which is terribly needed right now. But we all know New Jersey needs more than people willing to stand up to support working families. We need leaders with strong campaigns, and that can win. John and Chris are those leaders. They're making New Jersey government work for people again, and we need them to continue on in the assembly. A person who lived in Atlantic County for over 50 years saw a lot of politicians a lot of good leaders. But let me tell you something, people. We got two of the best right here in the assembly. John and Chris do one heck of a job. And I'm proud to sit here and endorse John Amadeo and Chris Brown. Thank you.